Hi guys, and welcome back to World of Tanks. Today we are at the bottom end of the tree. We are in the tier 5 Russian medium tank. Moving to support you. The T-34. This is a very good tank. I don't play this thing as much as I should, though. And I don't know why. Oh, it's a tier 7 game here, uh, by the way, here on Tundra. It's a, it's a straightforward standard battle. But yeah, I don't know why I don't play this thing <coughs> as much as I should. Yeah, I, I don't know why I don't play this thing much. Because it's a good tank. The armor is crap, but 45. Mm -hmm. the, nice the gun, two, two uh, guns. The 57 mil is this four, which has 112 penetration and does 85 damage. And uh, fires very quickly. Is it not very accurate, but has a really good aiming time? Or. There's a 76 millimeter gun which I never use on this set. Which has more penetration, more damage, but doesn't fire as quickly, it doesn't aim as quickly. Very, very mobile. It, it turns very fast, the turret turns very fast. It stops speed is 56 seconds, which is really, really good. Enemy armor is hit! few games in the T-34 actually. Alright guys, well just for you all, um, since we're having, since I'm going to play multiple games, I chose to uh, put the 76 millimeter gun on this thing, which I don't think I've ever played the T-34 with a 76 mil. I looked at the stats. Uh, this thing has a 2.9 second range. Just like time, turbos, really. Which is Hard shell, just but soft on the inside. Terrible. Especially for a fast and nimble tier 5 medium like this. It has a 125 average penetration, and which is okay. And it does 115 damage, which is okay. But kind of 
uh, on the lowest side, but okay. And the accuracy is terrible. And, you know, and it doesn't fire as quickly as the 57 mm So yeah, we'll have a few games with this gun. We'll have a few games with the 57 mm But the 57 mm is the gun that I always use on the T-34. This gun has 100, 156 penetration, which is very good. Well, that's not that much more for uh, T1 heavy. And the armor is damaged. Yeah, the aiming time is absolutely artillery missing me, which is nice. Look at this, guys. That's just horrible. And I missed still. Watch. We penetrated their armor. But it seemed like to me that this gun is a close-up, knife-fighting type of gun. Where you don't have to sit there and aim for 2.9 seconds. So I know that there's an IKV-103 probably in the bushes there, because he just hit me for 346 damage. And I decide, uh, I could possibly do more. Yeah, I'm gonna head to. to the east side. Using uh, 4 to 8, 8 to 4, which is just horrible. So let's uh, 9 to 4, jeez. So let's see, oh. Enemy is hit. Off the track. Time to move. Permission to engage. Kind of yeah, that was a horrible game. Next game. Alright, sticking with this 76 mil, mil millimeter gun, it's a tier 6 game here on Tier on Pilsen. And it's an encounter battle. So. This is not a sniping gun. Yeah. This is not a sniper. This is a flanking fast medium. Especially with this gun.
By the way, guys, yeah, I'm stunned and teleport for a while. Hey, I'm recording. Guys, I, I hope you didn't hear that. Are you thinking of what I'm thinking of in those... Oh. Mom! Mom! Don't say it on camera, but are you thinking of what I'm thinking? Mom, don't say it on camera, but are you thinking of what I'm thinking of past? Whoa. Even though it's not likely. Or don't say it on camera, but are you thinking of what I'm thinking of? Yes? Yes or no? Some, well, not to that extreme, what? Why she wants that. Sorry guys, back to the battle. I was just talking to my mom. Sorry about that. You know, dealing with life things. I want to flank this T-150. One of our tractors damaged. I want to run into the freaking pillar and get smacked by a leopard. Driving these things. How hard can it be? Oh, we fixed the track. Weapons are ready, gents. Let's do this. All right. Still using the seventy-six millimeter gun. It's a tier five game. Well, well that's nice. We're here on Outpost. It's a straightforward standard battle. After this, I'll probably after this or the next game, I'll probably switch to the 57 mil, just because that just because that is the best gun on this tank. And you guys will see proof of that in the when I do a garage review of this thing in the future. In the near future probably. Yeah, I would say. In in the near future. I'm gonna help this T1 heavy out here. Oh look. Speaking of T1 heavy. And look at this aim at time. That's just unacceptable for a tier 5 medium. Next time, make your weapons out of high grade titanium. Our radio operator is down!
take her out here? Nope. No cheese. Look at her. I'm back with the <coughs> um, 57 mil. It's a tier 6 game. Here on one of my favorite maps in Westfield. I'm a medium tank. I'm going straight up this hill and staying away from the town. Last game in the T34, it's a tier 6 game here on one of my favorite maps, Wild Park, and it's a standard battle. It is 1247 AM. I know I know the video has been paused for a long time. But I think I went ahead. According to my calculations, we have a 99.9% .9 chance of victory today. To the west side of the map here. And yes, I am using the 57 mil, um, millimeter gun still, so for the, for the last. Game. Oh wow, what is shot. damaged? On the 5916, I was not really even aimed. Well, sort of, but not really. to hit their vulnerable points. Enemy armor is damaged! We're in a practice destroyer! 
damage to track repaired. Let's move. The main gun is destroyed. Our gun is repaired. Oh my gun was. Thirty-four tier five Russian medium tank. I hope you guys enjoy that video. Make sure to take care of yourself. Make sure to be yourself as always, and I'll see you all next time. Bye for now.